So, Teeny, this General So, Martini, that's what we're doing. Anyway, this is a gin-based drink. Um, don't let that scare you. All gin is, is flavored vodka. Yeah, I think that's a big one for people. I don't think they understand uh, yeah. the origin of it. Can you explain that a little bit more, hon? Gin is vodka, and it's flavored with uh, primarily juniper and some other herbs, and depending upon the uh, type of gin you get, it could have other uh, flavors in it, like uh, uh, rose petals or cucumber, uh, which go very nice with, this, like if you're doing a sakatini. Uh, but that's all it is. It's just flavored vodka. Anyway, so we're doing um, some gin. We're gonna do a little bit of Aperol. Now Aperol, man, this has a lot of storytelling in it. First, I have to tell you about gin. Now I'm going to tell you about Aperol, which is sort of like Campari, but lighter, sweeter, and low in alcohol. And if you don't like Campari, but you want to like Campari, Aperol is a good introduction to that world. Um, it's really nice uh, just on its own with club soda with maybe a slice of orange. Um, but it's got, it's, it's a bitter, it's kind of got this bitter grapefruit kind of vibe. That's what Aperol is all about. And Campari is like an intenser version of that. Um, we're going to add some simple syrup, which I'll I've said it before, I'll say it again. Half sugar, half water. Heat it up till the sugar melts and then store it in one of these little squeezy bottle things. Now, um, you could use regular orange juice in this drink. I'm using, just because we still have some left over because it was uh, blood orange season, I'm using blood orange juice. I just like the color of it. It's a little sweeter than orange juice, I think. Um, and delicious. So it's delicious. Yeah. And, you know, the Italians use blood orange juice instead of orange juice all the time. And my last name's Cusimano, so I'm going to go with the blood orange juice. <laughs> Um, that's kind of, oh, I'm going to add, because we're doing, uh, General So's chicken, I'm going to add some Sichuan peppercorns just to spice up the drink a little bit. Um, oh, I love it when you do that. Rachel Super loves it because they, they, it kind of tingles your lips a little bit. So I'm just doing a bar spoon of Sichuan peppercorns right in the glass. And shoot this with ice. And as you can see, I, um, we're doing this up in a martini glass. So if you put ice in your martini glasses, when you start making the drink, they will be nice and chilled by the time you're done making the drink. So that is a nice little tip. You're nice and chill. I'm chill. Not. When have you ever been chill? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my wife knows me so well. <laughs> So then just strain it into your nice cold glasses. And there you have it. Your so teeny. So it's time for the teeny? It's time for it's teeny time. <laughs> it's teeny time. Cheers, Cheers. everybody.